There you are. Let's move. security than I thought. More worried about the parade? <laughs> Guess things have changed. They got higher priorities. Personally, I think that's a good thing. The city's size, on the other hand. The robed men won't be easy to find. They're definitely not here. Let's head into town. We cannot let Midgar wait. Not on Any idea what that is? The highway. Shinra's pride and joy. The fastest, most advanced airship in the fleet. Screw the boat. Let's take that. Unless you got a trained crew and piloting skills we don't know about, we're sticking with the boat. That's too bad. Would have been perfect. Hey, beggars can't be choosers. I've never seen No, we'll leave them be. For now. <laughs> Enter. An emissary from Wutai is here, sent by Viceroy Saruf. Oh? He introduced himself as Colonel Glenn Ladbrock. All right. I thought you were dead. <laughs> then you thought right. Let's cut to the chase, Mr. President. The Viceroy and your late father had big plans. I assume you intend to carry them out? Correct. That's good to hear. Some people just don't have the stomach for war. And this battle for the Magnus Materia demands commitment from both Wutai and Shinra. Thank you, I'm aware. But my father is dead, which changes the equation. A new vision is required. You always did prefer to march to the beat of your own drum. This new vision include your fairy tale promised land? <laughs> you Shinras, you take and you take, and you never give back. Left to you, this world would end up an empty husk. But war can put things right, beget anger, desolation, hatred, and in its wake, new unity. A people rejuvenated, and a planet once more made whole. What we're doing's for the greater good. Just gotta know when to ease off the gas. Now listen. 
You started this, remember? No more playing the idle air. You have obligations to fulfill. <laughs> Let's give the people what they deserve. Oh, right. Before I leave, a message from the Viceroy. Congratulations on your inauguration, Mr. President. Shinra has a bright future. Pretty psyched for the parade, huh? More like eager to prance around for the new paymaster. <laughs> now, I know what y'all gonna say, but I gotta ask. What? If Rufus is in town, are we really gonna let this opportunity pass us by? Hmm. Hell, I'm not saying we kill the man, but we ought to at least give him a talking to. Rough him up a little, maybe, you know? Actually, I'm gonna have to agree. First, the Turks say, do whatever, we're not after you. But then, Cloud's biker buddy rolls up and says he is. We gotta straighten this out. Okay, but how? We can't just walk up to the president in the street. Maybe we can. Huh? We bust up his parade! No. That's how we die in a hail of bullets like a bunch of dumbasses. The city's crawling with Shinra troopers. We join the parade. Hide in plain sight. Get in, get close, get answers. Seriously? Sure. Wow, that's good. No arguments here. Barrett, Brett. You guys find a route to the port. See what security's like. And keep an eye out for black robes while you're at it. Now hold up! Fatigues won't be enough to disguise you two. <sighs> True enough. Shut up. All right, see you in a bit. I gotta go find a uniform. Oh, we're coming with. I'm so pumped for this. This way? Yeah. Attention all troopers. Spare uniforms can be found here. Please get changed. The ceremony will be starting soon. Now we're talking. They're actually kind of cool. Well, ready to suit up? Yep. <laughs> Whoa there. Uh. Three steps back, if you please. What do you think you're doing? In a while. Don't forget, you have an act. 
Hold it! It's the damnedest thing! But I don't recall seeing the three of you in practice. Am I to assume that you simply... forgot? Sorry, sir. Sorry, sir! You're sorry? Do you have any idea how important today's ceremony is? Do you maggot? Form check now! You will give your commander a flawless performance! And if you show her anything less than perfection... I'll feed your ass to a behemoth! Now what? Just follow my lead. I still remember the basics. I'm having second thoughts, you guys. What the hell are you doing over there? The commander is waiting! Sir! Attention! Have to hand it to you three. You've got guts skipping out on practice. That, or you're idiots. Let's find out, shall we? I'm not about to take any chances today. I'm warning you now, though. One slip up and I'll chuck you straight into a Marlboro's mouth. Clear? I must say, 
You've impressed me. <clears throat> He'd serve as a sterling example to the others, ma'am. Congratulations! You are hereby promoted to Parade Captain of Midgar's 7th Infantry. You will be our model trooper, the one to march at the head of our drill team. Which means that our performance, satisfactory or otherwise, is now your responsibility. Ma'am! As parade, Captain, you will round up your fellow troopers currently on leave in Larvor Junon. You will recall that, to march in the parade, each drill team is required to muster five units or more. Look for the Seventh's Brassards. They'll identify the best from the rest. Once assembled, you and the team will report to Starboard Junon. Tardiness will not be tolerated. Now, make us proud! Bam. Bam. Lucky. Hey, you sure about this? Is the parade really gonna get us to Rufus? The parade won't. But the presidential commendation will. That's how these things go. The president himself gives the award. Wow. That's some plan. I mean, it's risky, but... Gotta go big or go home, right? the troops, Captain? Yeah. Just remember, Midgard, 7th Infantry. Anyone with one of these guys, right? Come on. Everybody ready? Ooh, perfect timing, Captain. Would you mind taking the picture so I can get in there? Whenever you're ready, sir! Thanks a bunch. Wow, Captain! Who knew you were such a pro? I might just have to frame this. Break time's over, people. The parade's about to begin. Follow me. Yes, sir! Drink with us. You're gonna have to lose the helmets. No scout, no service. <laughs> well, what are you waiting for? Unless 
Are you three mob heads? Wait! He's our new captain. He didn't know. <sighs> Sir, this place is for the clean shaven. You need to prove that you belong or leave. Uh. R &R's over, people. Seventh, outside. Sir! Right away, sir! Drink here. The helmet has to go. <laughs> Still haven't assembled your team, Captain? Have you checked the barracks? Get your team in order, Captain. Listen up. As we march, the eyes of the whole world will be watching us. And we, uh... And we cannot, we will not, let our great city of Midgar down. Failure is not an option. It's a big ask, but we can do it, together. Because we have our captain to guide us. Look to him, trust in him, and he will lead us to victory, so long as we follow. Isn't that right, sir? Uh, right. Now bring it home. Today is our day. It was made for the 7th Infantry. We will win that commendation for our city. And we will return home as champions! Yes, sir! Who's gonna show the rest of them how it's done? We are! I can't hear you! We are! Captain, the parade's about to start. Don't wanna be late, sir. Of course. When did we last use her? Five years ago, sir. Let's blow off the dust. But, but sir... Even a ceremonial display would constitute a violation of the ceasefire. Wutai would view it as a willful act of aggression. And? It's a new era. Let's ring it in with a bang. <laughs> Very good, sir. Very good. Nothing like fireworks to rouse the spirits. Mr. President, it's time. celebration of the century. As you can see, the streets of Junon are abuzz with excitement. People have turned out in droves to catch a glimpse of the new president, Rufus Shinra. And here comes Midgar's mobile unit. Their incredible skills are truly a sight to behold. this crowd. Uh, 
Uh, the president has stopped. Ready to fire, sir. Welcome to the New World Order. Gentlemen, with a single blast of Junon's famous cannon, Rufus Shinra has announced his arrival. Junon as the final team of the day takes their position. Ladies and gentlemen, I give you Midgar 7th Infantry. The captain and his team have trained long and hard, determined to win the presidential commendation for everyone back home in Midgar. I can't wait to see what kind of performance they'll put on today. Troopers of the 7th Infantry make us proud. Left, face. Formation, change! So far, so good! They're not in step! Final sequence! Begin! Oh, that's going to cost them. But they can surely do better. Such excellent direction. The captain needs to rally his troops. That concludes the first part of today's performance by the 7th Infantry Drill Team. Our judges are currently tabulating the votes from you, the viewers. And here they are now. It seems like a lot of you think the team is marching to the beat of their own drum. Perhaps the captain's orders weren't clear enough? Let's hope they manage to turn it around. Left, face. First sequence, begin. Maybe they're still warming up. That's not bad at all. I can't take my Second eyes off. Sequence. Them. Begin. That practice is paying off. It all looks so effortless. You're watching History in the Making. And with that, the 7th Infantry concludes the second part of their performance. As ever, Step our judges have been busy TV. tallying all the votes we've received. So let's take a look at the results. Universal acclaim, and little wonder given the skill and coordination on display. Keep this up and the seventh might well be destined for glory. I wouldn't bet against them. Drill team, halt! First sequence, begin! They still got a chance. Is something wrong? Formation change. 
This is looking promising. What a performance! Final sequence! Begin! They're in perfect sync! Their movements are so crisp and clean! And with that, we've reached the end of the 7th <laughs> Infantry's performance. Okay. Uh, sorry about that. For the final time, the judges are tallying the votes from you, the viewers. <laughs> and now, let's see the results. Listen to that crowd. Judging by this response, it's clear that Midgar's 7th Infantry has made a lot of new fans. There's no denying it, folks. That was a performance for the ages. Stay tuned to find out. Yes, sir. Around the clock. They remain unaware. Leave them to me. I want you and your people tracking the ropes. Understood. We're back on the clock. I trust you know the mission by now. to congratulate you on the stirring performance you've done your company proud. Your passion and patriotism is beyond question, and I know our president can't wait to thank you all. Hmm. Of course, some among you are deserving of special praise. For our first award, we will recognize the division whose exemplary display eclipsed all others. The prize for outstanding performance goes to... Midgar's mobile unit! We practiced! Come on up, Commander! Aye, aye! If you would do the honor, sir. The late president, my father, single-handedly turned a small arms manufacturer into the greatest company the world has ever seen and transformed all of our lives with the miracle of Mako. So I invite you to join me in a moment of silence for a great man gone too soon. We live in challenging times. Some may feel that I am too young, too inexperienced to lead us. But to them and to you all, 
I say this. The Shinra Electric Power Company will endure. The challenges we face can't be overcome if we summon our courage and cut ties with the past. Yesterday is behind us. We must look instead to the promise of tomorrow, for today is a new day, and the first of a long, arduous journey which we must take together. Follow me, and we will reach our promised land. This I do solemnly swear before you all, as president of the Shinra Electric Power Company. My friends, place your trust in me, and together will we achieve our dream of a better world. a commendation to present. The award goes to Midgar's 7th Infantry. <laughs> To accept this award on behalf of the team, three of the best will now join me. Come on up. The president has invited three members of the 7th Infantry to come and accept the award on the drill team's behalf. Salute! Your performance today was nothing short of incredible. Midgar's 7th Infantry is, without a doubt, the pride of our people. Congratulations. <laughs> With generous praise, the President offers his congratulations to the team. One can only imagine what those three troopers will be I have a few private words to say to these troopers. Cut the feed. Sir! You! You're on crowd control! That ain't right. Excuse me! Need to get through! Barrett! Over there! Of all the times... I rarely talk to the rank and file. Why not take off your helmet? Cloud Strife. That was a first class performance. One worthy of a soldier. Stand down. But, sir! You are a fascinating individual, Cloud Strife. Your file was as gripping as it was enlightening. Which is why I have a proposition for you. At present, Midgar requires my full and undivided attention. The city is Shinra's beating heart. Its devastation is a humiliation, and the world must see us rebuild. To that end, I need to refocus my efforts and push certain duties to one side. Get to the point. My father left me a mountain of unfinished tasks, like the recapture of a fugitive of ancient descent. 
the recovery of a stolen lab specimen, and of course, the arrest and execution of Avalanche. None of which, frankly, are of any interest to me whatsoever. I'd gladly wash my hands of it all. So what? You're gonna let us go? Just like that? Yes. Provided you keep your distance from Midgar, that is. No more stirring the proverbial pot. And the same goes for me? But why? Because I have a new vision for Shinra. So we go free. And you get... Sephiroth, dead. <laughs> He's an unsavory relic of our past. And I want him gone. But in our current state, Shinra lacks the resources to get the job done. So I turn to you. It's a deal. You have a lead, I take it. The guys in black robes. Clever you. You know who they are, don't you? According to Hojo, they're connected to Sephiroth. Shadows of the Man, I believe he called them. Follow them and you'll find him. Right. Seems like a good way up. ourselves a deal then only if you can honor it no one comes for us not hojo not the turks no one take your time you have my you word. know you can do this <laughs> here goes gotcha stop <laughs> get down <laughs> Get over here! Ah, uh, so that's your game. It wasn't us. Spare me. You had your chance. Sir, please! Swing the rooftops now! Don't let them get away! <laughs> Yuffie! That was her, right? Yep. What do we do? Get the hell out of here. Hey. 
What happened to Rufus? Long gone. Shit. So what now? I saw one of the robed men. He was headed for the port. Let's follow him. Place is on alert. Are you sure about that? We've still got the uniforms. Go on without me. I'll take care of the 7th Infantry. Throw him off the scent. Alone? You sure? Trust me. It's easier this way. Captain! Get going. Sir, your orders! Just received new intel. The suspect is en route to Larbor Junon. I'm to convey this information to all nearby units. Go join the search. I'll catch up. If I may, sir. We've heard rumors that there are others in league with the terrorists. Conspirators in stolen uniforms. For your own safety, sir, allow us to accompany you. Midgar 7th Infantry never leaves a man behind! Right. If the enemy is among us, other units are a potential threat, and we must treat them as such. Uh, good point. But you can trust us, sir. Like we trust you. We'll alert all units from here to the port elevator. When that's done, we'll regroup with the rest in Larbor Juna. Got it? Yes, sir! You really ought to have told me you wanted to join the parade, my friend. The mobile unit would have loved to have you. <laughs> hmm. Oh dear. My quarry has cast you aside. How tragic. <laughs> Fans of ours! Didn't you know? You and I are living legends. I got this. Sir. Oh, isn't it exciting? The two of us together again at long last. Picture it! A duel to end all duels. Are we fighting or what? Let's not get ahead of ourselves. We have to set the stage. First, the music! Let's not forget the lights!
I fear our audience finds this sport underwhelming. And we have a reputation to live up to. was ours alone. Ladies and gentlemen, I give you your champion! <laughs> I must say, you have proven yourself as a capable leader of men. Then again, I expected nothing less than the best. As a leader of my own band of brothers, I hold you in the highest respect. And so for you, our fearless captain, a gift. I insist. You guys head Lardboard without me. 
Sir, I have to ask. Oh, the jackass with the bike? He's... a jackass. That we know, sir. What I wanted to ask is, why you keep trying to shake us? Are we really that much of a burden to you? <sighs> or, are you the assassin everyone's looking for? For what it's worth, I want you to know. I'm sorry. <laughs> no need to take the joke that far, Captain. We know the culprit's a young woman, just lightening the mood. But we get it. You clearly have things to do. Things you can't divulge to us. We're sorry that we didn't see it sooner, sir. Sorry, sir! It's okay. At ease. The fact is, we would have never won that commendation if you hadn't brought us all together. I might be out of line for saying this since we only just met, but... The Seventh feels more like a family than ever, and we hope you feel the same. You're not out of line. It's been an honor, Trooper. But you're right. It's time you guys went your way, and I went mine. Will we see each other again, sir? <laughs> Count on it. I'm just relieved the president is okay. Can we please set sail already? Just trust in shit. Think they caught whoever was behind that attack yet? <sighs> you okay? Yeah. Great. Now then. Let's not keep our friends waiting. We better get in line. All right, next. They're screening passengers. What now? We try the back door. Just trust in Shinra and things will be fine. 